Hey, Nanny. Holy man, you finally came back. I was so worried about you. No, Nanny, Julia. Julia? Where's your mother? Did she leave you alone again? Nanny. Forget it. Oh, well. At least you're safe here with me. Your mother should be back from the store any minute. Sheets, right? Absolutely. I think you want a round two right now. I want to for round two, not today. Oh my god, what time is it? I don't know. Oh, fuck, get up! Okay, get the fuck out. dude, just calm down. I will go out the back, you stall your wife, okay? Alright, alright. All right. I'm sorry. I just... We definitely gotta do this at your place next time. <laughs> I live with a Christian mother, so that sounds like a big no. You live with your mom? You have a wife and kids? <sighs> Keep it. I'll get you a uh, Blu-ray player and a Netflix account. Babe, I don't need all of that. Well, I'm gonna give it to you anyways. Give you some time to think it over. Well, all right then. All right, I gotta get going. Okay, baby. Mm. Have fun in school now. Sorry I've been so MIA this week, but I've been super busy. Sure. What's that? This is the answer. Anna's mind was kind of like a, a weird, mixed up puzzle, but I think I pieced most of it together. Okay, and? Well, I think maybe you should read it. I'm tired of reading. Just tell me. The suicide. Uh, she meant to do it at Brian's party. Did she say anything about me? About you? I see what this is all about now. This is all about Steph. You want to know where it all went wrong, what happened? Well, good thing for you is that it's all in here, so read it. I can't. Can't or won't? What's that supposed to mean? You know, I'm starting to think that you're just like everybody else in this town. Shutting people out when they need you the most. 
too fucking scared or whatever to accept any of the differences that aren't your own. Well, fuck you! I'm not gonna let another person's voice go unheard in this town. Sorry, madam. No, just come on in. Well, I say thank you. Sorry to hear you. You want to cancel your service with us? I don't need the damn thing. There's never anything on it anyway. Nice TV. Daughter? It's my grandbaby, Juju. Isn't she precious? Like an angel, madam. Yes. I have to introduce you as soon as I get her away from that man. What man? Her father. He's a monster, you know. He's a monster. I'm just waiting for my chance to go in there and save my baby. I'm all she's got, you know. Her mother left. Would you like to meet her? I like it very much, madam. Have a great night, madam. Hey, hey, mister. Wait, hey, mister, ain't you gonna take that damn cable box? Friend, this a money journey for this? Yo, it's G Money now. Respect the name. Respect? Yeah, respect. <laughs> Whatever. Mom wasn't really too pleased about me moving in, but she's just happy that the baby ain't mine, so. <laughs> well, my mom is, she's still trying to, I guess, figure out, get comfortable with the whole coming out thing. Um, she's still trying to make me go to church, though. But I'm like, no, I feel uncomfortable in that space, you know? Why is that? Well, you know, being gay isn't Christian, and it's, you know, it's not black. So, when I go there, I get these stares from people, but it's who I am, so, deal with it. Is that why you didn't tell me? I didn't tell you, Brian, because, and don't take this the wrong way, you were very hard to talk to. You were self-centered, arrogant, homophobic, I mean, classic son of a preacher, man. Yeah. Look, I know I was an asshole back then. I don't have it out for gay people. Just because I'm a Christian, I'm just... I have certain beliefs, you know? <laughs> beliefs? Beliefs, Brian? You have had more premarital sex than anyone I know in this entire town, and you are coming at me because I do it with men? I'm not judging you, I'm just saying, you should have talked to me. Look, Brian, I kissed you in front of everybody. I apologize, I'm really sorry, but look, I'm not into you, okay? I'm not trying to convert you or whatever the fuck you think, okay? Look, I deleted the tweets, the Instagram post. I'm sorry. I fucked up. I'm human. I was angry. But you know what? I'm tired of being blamed for everyone's fucking problems. I'm not some miracle man, all right? I don't have all the answers. Who the fuck do you think you are, Brian? Huh? What'd you even come here for, huh? To clear the air, to get rid of your fucking guilt or whatever? You know what? I think I'm good on this.
Goodbye. Caleb, stop being so fucking no. dramatic. You don't even know what dramatic is, okay? You just wait.